I think that if we put in place a sound and well-constructed fiscal policy program right now, we enacted it now, and we either phased it in or deferred it with an enforcement mechanism, and that was built on top of what's already been done, I think it would be constructive and contribute significantly to growth and jobs in the short term, as well as being absolutely imperative for the long term. In other words, I think the point is that deficit reduction, if it's soundly constructed, or soundly constructed program, would be very constructive for the short term, as well as being imperative for the long term. And I think in the short term, there basically be three advantages. Number one, I speak to a fair number of people who run companies on a regular basis because it's part of what I do. And I don't think there's any question that now and for quite some time, our fiscal outlook, which is unsustainable certainly over time, our fiscal outlook has created a lot of uncertainty about future policy, and that in turn has deterred hiring and investment. And it has heightened the concern about whether we can govern, all of which has been a detriment to current job growth. Uh, secondly, with the sequester in place, if you put in place instead of that <laughs> a program of the kind I've just described, you could phase it so that you would avoid, either avoid completely or at least greatly reduce fiscal drag. And finally, at least the way I would construct uh, a fiscal program, you would defer the implementation for a limited time to give yourself time for some growth, and you could put a moderate upfront stimulus on it, so that I think that our current fiscal situation has seriously impeded hiring and seriously impeded job growth. And I think if you put in place kind of program that I very briefly got at but didn't fully describe, I think it'd be very constructive.